Welcome to Gold Market Update Charts of the Day. It's the 14th of March 2024. Mike Smith in Analyst at Gold Markets to lead you around what's happening in markets today as we are now well through the Asian session. US equities struggled to move higher overnight. It was on the Dow, the three major indices that finished in positive territory. Then Russell 2000 also posted small gains. We've got data releases pre market open tonight that may influence short term sentiment as we approach the back end of the week. US futures are mildly higher in early trading today. Asian markets are mixed. The ASX is trading down around a quarter of a percent, but material stocks are outperforming on the back of big gains in copper. European equity futures are pointing to a cautiously positive open this afternoon, but it's really choppy in markets this morning with the indices. US dollar index has given up the gains in Asia today, may test support and gold as a result is looking to test record highs once again, may head towards 2200 if this continues. We saw significant buying into copper, as I've already referenced, to move over $4 and to multi month highs, and all bounced off its 200 MA to test resistance on the WTI CFD contract around $80. Bitcoin edged over 73,000 to hit new highs, and US data dominates today with weekly jobs, PPI, and retail sales all due an hour before US market open. A couple of charts that caught our eye today. Start by looking at Kogan in the online retail space and you can see it's pushed hard up against this resistance at around about 8.57. Let's bring this in a little closer. You can see we've tested this level the last four sessions. Um, why is it important? Well, if we look at a weekly chart, we can see there was some significant price action back here in the beginning of last year. If we should breach this level, then there's a possible move up to 10.25 in the short term, which would be a 16% rise from current price today. We may get a pause at around about 9.70, and that's really the target I would be interested in looking at. In the FX world, uh, some interesting action on the US yen. You can see there we're gradually moving back up to this 148.11 level. We think there's a fairly high probability move up to the R2 pivot level at 148.50. So a gain of around about 37 to 40 pips is potentially on the cards. Worthwhile being patient with that one. Trade safe and see you again soon. Bye bye for now.